Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to bring you guys along my accommodation tour. Well, I stay at Salisbury Court at the University of Bath and as you can see, I live on the fourth floor and there's no lift. So it's quite a hike to go to my accommodation every day, but come on in. So I live on the top floor and upon going in, you need to scan your card. In my flat, there's eight rooms, or maybe seven. Eight? Seven? I think seven. <laughs> and we share a kitchen, but I'm not going to show you because it's in a state right now. But yeah, I'm in the first room, so let's go in. Ta-da! <laughs> first thing I do when I come into my room is change to my room slippers. It's also pink. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, come on in. Welcome to my room! Can you guys guess my favorite color? I mean, it's clearly very, very obviously pink. When you first move in, there's like two plain pin boards. So one here and one there. And then there's the bed and the closet and then the table and the shelf it was all empty and i basically decorated everything and i'm gonna show you guys in detail how i decorated my room we have this wall which i call the memory memorabilia wall where i put a lot of sentimental things so i kind of divide it into like photo booth pictures and some tickets. This was like a movie ticket, train ticket, club entry. <laughs> and yeah, these are all my friends. And then here I have my shopping wall so I can keep track of everything I bought. I mean, there was more, but this was the ones that I remember to put here. And this was the first time when I voted. This was a meaningful thing to me. This was from like my Christmas dinner. This is like my uni map. When I first moved in, I didn't know where anything was. So I had to look at this every time before I went out. And this was like my Freshers. Freshers week wristband. I really, really like this wall. It's so cute. And I filled it up in like five months. Below the pin board, we have my shoe rack. And it's not very con... What's that word? Conventional? Practical? <laughs> practical! Yeah, it's not very practical because it can't really fit all my shoes. Like, I have to put my other shoes here. But it's nice because I can sit down and wear my shoes when I need to wear my shoes. Now, let me show you guys a tour. Um, first, we have my weight loss hula hoop. <laughs> and then we have my clubbing shoes and my other Crocs. Like, I put my favorite shoes here. So this is like the Travis Scott dunks or maybe that's jordan i have no idea <laughs> and then we have my lv arch light we have my g dragon kwando um i don't, don't even know what series this is and then my blue dunks because the rest of my shoes are so ugly here i also keep like heels and my cowboy boots not cowboy boots just boots but pink boots Let's just put that back in. And then these are all my beloved shoes. As you can probably tell, I really, really love my shoes. Moving on. Okay, guys, we had to turn on the lights because it was getting pretty dark. On this wall is where I call it like my postcard and mood board wall. So I got these prints from Amazon. And then these are postcards from like my friends and family. Mostly like my mom. She sent me like majority of it. When my friends go on holiday or when my mom goes on holiday, I tell them to send me postcards. It's really cute because you think it's just a picture but at the back there there's like a love message they wrote for me which is so cute and then we have my bed it's all pink this trill is from primark if i'm not mistaken and then this one's from ikea when you first move in there's one pillow but then i bought two more pillows and it's also from ikea yeah so my pink bed i spend a lot of time in my bed and then next to my bed we have this bedside table I have my <laughs> other phone here card holder hair clip i guess i don't know why that's the hair claw this is my diamond ring from <laughs> wink 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 and this is just like random stuff and i have a nail care hair clip here there's like two sockets next to my bed and then the switch to turn on a light and usb plug and then under here we have my traditional clothes you'll know why i put this here when i show you my closet and just random stuff and then below here i have my 
weighing my weighing machine is that what it's called weighing scale weighing scale <laughs> it's also pink but i don't really weigh myself anymore because it upsets me and my ipad cover is like the keyboard one it was so expensive and i don't use it because it's way too heavy to carry anyway moving on to the fun part my closet jing 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 Ta-da! So there's a full length mirror over here like on the closet door and then we have all my jackets that I hang here. I don't have much space so I always like double hang and look at my favourite pink sweat set. I love pink. And I bought this from Shopee Malaysia or maybe Amazon, I don't remember. I think Shopee. And I put my scarves here towels, caps, and my pajamas here and then over here I put um, gloves and socks and blah 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 I have three baskets here so the first basket the first basket has like my tube tops and my like singlets the middle basket has oh, <laughs> has my bra and underwear and socks and the last basket has my workout clothes which I don't really wear a lot and oh also my safety shorts so yeah I like to keep it organized that way these baskets are from Flying Tiger, if I'm not mistaken. These are all my tops and these are all my bottoms. And it's filled to the brim. It's like I layered, like there's two layers. So at the back and the front and it's all right until the top. It's good that I have just this closet because I stopped shopping. There's no space to put any clothes. Above my closet, I have two organizers. This one is just bed sheets. I think like my extra bed sheets. And this one is my stuff and then i have an air freshener here moving on to this side of the room i have four organizers here and this ikea bag is filled with like paper bags and plastic bags which my shopping bags and then i reuse them and over here there's just stuff that i use often so my pink rice cooker we have eggs because i eat eggs every day and i don't have space in the kitchen and i have some sauces and my pesto and mortar mm -hmm. but it's not brick i mean it's Batu. not it's not <laughs> stone but, yeah it's not stone so it's made out of wood and then we have my vida c collection it's definitely finishing so please send me more i have this mug from paris that my mom bought me and she also bought me this thing she was like oh when you go to class you can use this to drink coffee it stays warm the whole day and i'm like mom i don't even drink coffee the only drink i drink is water but thanks anyway let me just put everything back i'll show you each organizer so this the first organizer i just have like handbags and like some backpack and then this one is like all my laundry cleaning stuff the third one is a bunch of random things so i'm not going to show it to you guys and then this one is just like a bunch of food like junk food i try not to snack so i don't really touch this and let's move on to my table so first we have this organizer this one, it, I don't know why, this has a Sainsbury card thingy And then hair ties, lollipops, and lipsticks, blah 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 And then these are my blue light glasses And then I have this body spray from Lush, the Sakura one I use it as a room spray I can't even smell Does it smell nice, Shazia? Yeah, it does <laughs> <laughs> And then I brought this Chupa Chups from Malaysia Because I went through a lollipop phase Where I really really wanted to eat Chupa Chups But they did not have it in UK I went to like 5 different candy shops and I couldn't find it And then on Amazon it was so expensive So I brought a whole balang And I have my like, camera charger here And then this photo frame of my beloved people I miss them so much Honestly, one of my highlights of last year was my AirAsia internship It was so fun I have my iPad here and then a pink stand I have my phone and laptop charger My flowers from you know who <laughs> If you watch my Valentine's vlog, thank you It's almost dead but this is probably the last day I'll be here <laughs> And then my laptop, my airpods, my airpods max Oh, this table mat, I bought it from Amazon also and it's pink I really like it because it makes my table look less plain and I have my Brita jug and I drink a lot of water so I always just refill my pink bottle Here, yeah, come on closer Shall I put on the light? Mm -hmm. I have um, my hair products so I use this oil 
and I use this like as heat protectant, dry shampoo and hairspray and this is my beloved Dyson and also my beloved hair coat thing and then I have like a small organizer I usually only touch this section when it's close to exams and I need to study and then I have like a cute little lion you know, I don't actually really like lions, but the reason why I like lions is because it's close to my name. Because if you add an A at the back, then it becomes Leona, so... Leona the lion! <laughs> this is a cheap carpet I bought from Sheen. It was like maybe £20 or slightly more, I don't remember. But I feel like it really complements my room and makes it feel more cosy. And then I have my laundry basket here and my vacuum. I bought this on Amazon when I first moved in because I didn't know that we have a vacuum in the room. Anyway, in the flat. I don't even vacuum all the time but I swear because England is more cold than um, Malaysia, it's so freaking dusty. I literally get not allergies but I'm always sneezing because of the dust. And then I have um some Malaysian snacks in here. I really like this bag. It's from Safe and you can buy it. I'll link it in the description if you want. This is usually my shop, my grocery bag. And then this is my food bin. Um, you can see my diet. It's not very healthy. <laughs> but I have like 10 packs of surrounding. So if anybody wants beef floss, please comment down below and I'll give it to you. Because there's no way I can finish like 10 packs before I go back to Malaysia for summer. And then... We have my, I should have showed you this at the start, but this is my coat hanger. You can't even see the hanger because I hang so many stuff. Like my scarf, my coat, and these are basically things that I wear like on the daily. And then behind my entrance door, my door entrance, <laughs> um, I have like two coats. This is the white puffer I always wear. And then these two bags are the ones that I use to lecture a lot. And this is my toilet mat. It's from Ikea as well, and it's pink. Obviously. Let's go in my toilet. Ta-da! When you open it, there's my towel hanging right at the door. And this is my toilet. I always do my makeup in my toilet because I like to stand while doing my makeup and get really close to the mirror. And I felt like it looks so messy when I put it on my table. So I put it in the toilet. This like little rack is perfect for all my makeup. And then I just have like some products here. Below my sink, I have the bin which is given by the uni. You can buy a pink bin if you want. But you know, we only stay here for like 8 months a year. So I don't think there's any use buying so many things, right? I have my toilet paper roll here. And then this is my toiletry supply basket. We just have random stuff like extra toothbrush, toothpaste, razors toilet roll, pads, and I always get stains on my clothes. So I have vanish, makeup remover, lotion, and makeup pads. And then next to it, I have like, when I hand wash my clothes in the toilet, I use this one. And then my toilet cleaner stuff. <laughs> I have a watering can because I used to use this as a big day, but it was so like, not practical. So I stopped using that and I used a water bottle instead. And then my toilet has this like pink soap thingy. It had to be pink. You know what? The little details matter and even my toilet brush is pink. And then we have my speaker. Fun fact, I don't really listen to music. I only listen to music when I shower. That's like 5 minutes, 15 minutes a day. And then we have this hanging shower basket. And these are all the products that I use. Olaplex, everything. And then this loofah. Uh, it's not pink because I got it for free from my cousin. So yeah, beggars can't be choosers. If I bought it, it probably would have been. It probably would have. Would. It probably would have been pink. And then I don't use the soap bar. I use like the liquid soap. Yeah, I just put it here. And then this is my shower. Before I end my video, I'll tell you guys a bit more about my room. I'm not really sure what the dimensions of it is. <gasps> Oh no, I almost forgot another spot. There's a drawer underneath my table and you can move it. So you can even pull it out, all the way out. But it takes too much space, so I leave it here. So in the first drawer, we have my many, many perfumes and my many, many blue light glasses. And these are jewelry that I use all the time. Hair ties, spare change, and hair clips, and lip balm. And then the second one, I have like stationery, these are like pins from my pin board, then my hard drive because I'm a YouTuber, you know. Yeah, it's just like stationery stuff and hot glue gun, blah blah blah. 
Oh, I want to show you guys something. Even my calculator is pink. I'm telling you guys, the little details really do matter to me. So if I could, I would want every single thing I own to be pink. And then here, I just have like, this is my first aid kit with like paracetamol and stuff. Polaroid albums, Lemsip strap seals, and these are like random products. And my jewelry is down here. I don't usually wear jewelry, honestly. And then my pink umbrella is here. Ah, yeah, that's about it. Oh, now that I'm showing you under my table, I'll just show you everything. So underneath my desk, I have a broom. A sweep. A broom. A broom. And then we have my pink luggage here because it can't fit up there. I think some people keep their luggage up there, but I don't have any space. I have like three luggages in here. And underneath my bed, I also forgot to show you guys. I have a laundry hanger. Drying rack. Oh yes, <laughs> drying rack. Sorry. <laughs> And a luggage. And this is for when I do hand washing. So I have a pink bucket. I don't know why my English is suddenly so bad. But I think this is... Is this called bucket? Yeah. A pink bucket to do hand washing. Oh my god. it's It was kind of dusty. Okay, so before I end this video, I just want to say... I have one last thing to show you guys. So this is the coolest part of my room. Let me just turn off all the lights. I see the pink LED lights. So this is probably my favorite favorite part of the room. You can change the color to anything that you like. So next to my bed, we have like this, this thingy. And then let me show you guys. Back off, back off. Can you see the color? Yes. Okay. Whoa. But you know, my favorite color is pink, so it's always this color. That is probably my most favorite feature of my room. It's built in and they have it in two accommodations which is Salisbury and Quads. But guys, Salisbury is so much better than Quads. There's so much space. Honestly, there's enough space to like <laughs> work out and you have space from your desk and to your bed and yeah, in front of your closet. Quads is... Quads suck. If you're gonna apply to uni above, I would definitely recommend staying in Salisbury Court. The rent is about £197 a week. That's what I pay. It might go up next year because of the cost of living. I have no idea. Yeah, anyway, I hope you liked my room tour and if you liked it, please give me a like, comment, and please subscribe to my channel and let me know what you want to see in the next video. Bye-bye!